this problem from pair of straight line and the problem is if the equation ax square plus 2hxy plus by square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c this is equal to 0 this is the general equation of second degree in x and y will represent a pair of intersecting line then show that the square of the distance of the point of intersection of the straight line from the origin is given by this okay that is if this is the coordinate axis x axis and y axis this is origin and if this pair of straight line represent this pair these are O dash, this is A and this is B. These are the pair. Then we have to find the point of intersection and this is the distance. Distance from the origin to the point of intersection. Okay. And also we have to find the square of the distance. So we have to find this is if it be alpha beta, the point of intersection, then this is alpha square, beta square, full square. That is alpha square plus beta square. This is 0, 0. Okay. We have to find the value of alpha square plus beta square and we prove this is equal to this. Okay. We first let two point or two, sorry, two intersecting line are represented by one is Lx plus My plus M. This is equal to 0. And other is L dash X plus M dash Y plus N dash equal to 0. This two line, this is given by two, represented by the given pair of equation or pair of straight line one. Now to find the point of intersection, we solve these two equation by cross multiplication. Okay, and we give or we get x by this is m n dash minus m m dash y by this is this is n l dash minus n n dash l and this is l m dash minus l dash m okay so we get the value of x this is given by n m n dash minus n m dash by l m dash minus l dash m and y this is equal to given by n l dash minus n dash l by l m dash minus l dash m right now we compare this line with the product of this line we get a x square plus 2 h x y plus b y square plus 2 g x plus 2 f y plus c this is equal to l x plus my plus n into l dash x plus m dash y plus n dash. Now comparing the coefficient of equal power of x and y or product of x y from both sides we get l l l dash this is given by a m m dash this is given by b and n n dash this is given by c now we compare 2g 2g what is 2g this is l m dash minus sorry plus m l dash this is equal to 2g this is the sorry this is not 2g this is 2h 2h because this is the coefficient of x y and the coefficient of x equating both side l n dash plus n n dash this is given by 2 g and we get m n dash minus m n n dash this is equal to 2 f okay we get all the relation by equating the coefficient now we write this relation as root under root under we write here directly root under this square and this square also and we apply the formula a minus b whole square this is equal to a plus b whole square minus 4a so we get m n dash plus n m dash whole square 
plus sorry plus not plus this is minus 4 ab ab means m m dash m m dash similarly the lower term is l m dash plus l dash m whole square minus 4 l l dash m m dash and we get from here we put m m dash m m dash plus m m dash this is given by this is not minus this is plus we put the value 2m that is 4m square minus this is 4 into m m dash this is 4ac sorry 4 4bc 4bc and in the lower term we put this is 4h square minus this is 4ab so we get the value is root over h square minus bc by h square minus a b. Okay. And similarly, by applying the same logic, we get this value is root over of g square minus ac by h square minus a b. Now we get the point of intersection which is given by alpha and beta. Okay. So point of intersection alpha comma beta, this is equal to root h square minus bc by h square minus ab comma root g square minus ac by h square minus ab this is the point of intersection now the square distance from the origin to the point of intersection is given by alpha square plus beta square so square distance This is equal to alpha square plus beta square means h square minus bc by h square minus ab plus g square minus ac by h square minus ab. And this is h square minus ab and the numerator is h square plus g square minus we take on c, c into a plus c. In our given result, this is given by a b minus h square. So we multiply numerator and denominator by minus 1 and getting the result as c into a plus b minus f square minus g square by a b minus h square. Okay, and this is our required result. So we put the result which we want to put. Okay, this is very very simple problem but important problem of pair of state line. Thank you, thank you for watching.